Hello everyone, Julie here. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am so excited because I'm gonna be doing another huge H&M haul. H&M has so many good winter pieces right now. Literally, I found so many great things and I'm really, really excited to share. Um, but what I'm also really excited about is a lot of the pieces look very high quality, but they're at an amazing price point, which is what I love. So if you guys want to check out my huge H&M winter haul, then keep watching. This first outfit I am so excited about. And first I have to show you the pants. Are these amazing faux leather. They're actually more like a legging. Um, they're in a chocolate brown color. I feel like on camera, they're filming like a little more purpley, but they're pretty much a true chocolate brown. And I love these. I saw these and I was like, I need them. I do have another pair of like faux leather, like joggers. Um, I do have a pair of black, more like legging type, but they were really expensive. So when I saw these and at, I think they were like, yeah, 25 bu bucks. I was like, I need these. Um, and honestly, they fit better than the really expensive pair I have. Um, I wanna say, the ex I got the expensive pair from, I think Revolve, and I, I wanna say they were like a couple hundred bucks, and I just feel like these fit my body a lot better, and I love, love, love them. Um, I got them in a size four, which at H&M at is my normal size, so. They fit perfect, they fit like a glove, they're nice and tight and snug, and I'm obsessed with them. Um, and then just to pair with that, I got this really cute knit turtleneck top. Um, it has kind of these like bigger, wider sleeves, and it's filming too, I feel like a little more gray, but it is more of like a brown sweater. Um, and I like that it's just like the little turtleneck, it's nothing too crazy. Um, and I really, really love it with the brown leather leggings. I feel like they look so good together too. I feel like this outfit can be kind of dressed more grunge or you can dress it up. Um, so I like that you can kind of go both ways with that. But then I paired it with this amazing, oh my God, this amazing faux fur jacket. You guys, this thing is insane. It is so soft. It's like the softest faux fur fabric faux fur fabric, it's really hard to say, ever. Um, and I love the fit, I love the length. It goes a little bit below my butt, which I feel like a lot of my jackets that I have in my closet right now are a little bit shorter, so I like that this one is a little bit longer. Um, it has pockets. It also does have the two little buttons in the front, so if you wanted to, you can button it. And then I love that the collar is a little bit thicker, so I kind of styled it down, and then I also styled it up and just like, super cozy looking. Um, this thing, just looking at it, I feel like should at least be $200. And it is $50, $50. That is so insane to me. Um, I went ahead and got this in a small and it fits me perfect. Oh, and then the sweater, didn't tell you guys the price on this one. This is 35 bucks and I ended up getting this in a medium. I wanted it just to like feel a little bit bigger. So I went up a size in this, just an FYI. But this entire outfit and just like the faux leather with the faux fur with like the knit. I love all the different textures together and I want to say this is like probably going to be my go-to outfit the rest of the year because I just love it so much. So if you guys don't have a shacket in your closet and that is a shirt slash jacket, you can wear it as a shirt or a jacket, you need one and you should probably just get this super cute gray one from H&M. Literally, I feel like this is the perfect jacket. Um, it truly can be worn as a button up top or as a jacket. I went ahead and styled it as a jacket and I feel like it's just very cool. I feel like this whole look is kind of street style um, and this thing is amazing. It is 30 bucks, which I feel like a lot of jackets out there are a lot more expensive because they can kind of go both ways. So people are jacking up the price. I feel like that's such a good price. Um, I went and got it in a small and I feel like it's the perfect like oversized jacket and it will like be able to be worn as a jacket so I could put stuff under it, but it's also small enough where it'll look cute as a shirt. So I really, really like this. And then with this, like I said, I wore it as a jacket and just styled this really cool hoodie underneath it. H&M has a lot of good graphic hoodies. They also have them in tees. Um, and I just saw this 
Coca-Cola one. And honestly, why I got this one is because it was kind of like this cream off-white color and then black. Um, obviously, if you've seen any of my videos, I'm kind of more in like to the neutrals right now. So that's why I got this guy. But if you aren't feeling these graphics, they had a ton of different other graphics. I think they had one that said Harvard. They had one that said friends. Um, but I really just got this guy because I liked the colorway. Um, I got this in an extra small and I actually think I might go back and size up it fits perfect. I think I just want it a little bit bigger. Um, so yeah, I guess it is kind of true to size because I feel like I do need the small in this. Um, and then this guy is only 25 bucks, which is such a good deal. Also, the inside of this is just so soft. It is insane. So I feel like this will be a good sweater to on not only wear with the shacket, but you could also wear it by itself. I feel like it'll keep you warm enough to wear it by yourself. And then I just popped the hood out. And then the pants that I wore with this, the cream pants, those are actually from, I wanna say like cotton on it, but H&M had literally identical ones. That's the only reason I didn't grab the H&M ones because I had the exact same ones already. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the link below for the H&M ones. Um, but yeah, I went ahead and just styled it with some like cream denim type pants and just rolled them up with it. And then I did it with my cool Nike sneakers. Um, I love this look, it's a little more street style. That's why I felt like I needed the sneakers, but you could totally do it with like a pair of combat boots or like some booties, but I feel like just with the hoodie popping out and the jacket, it just needed some, a sneaker moment. So I paired my blazers with this look. So the next piece I also styled with kind of those cream off-white colored denim pants. Um, and it is this awesome, I wanna say shacket, cause originally on the hanger, I was like, oh, this will be super cute as a shirt and a jacket. But for me, I'm 5'3", five, 5'4". Five, I think I'm a little too petite to wear this as a shirt. But if you're a little bit taller, I feel like you can totally pr pull this off. So I'm still gonna kinda call it a shacket, but for me, it's probably gonna be a jacket. Um, and that's how I styled it. I just put a black knit top underneath and then put this guy over it. But I love this thing. It is so comfy. I also love the fabric. It's kind of, it's not really like teddy, that like teddy fabric, a little bit, but I just really like this fabric. I don't really have anything like this in my closet. Um, so that's kind of what drew me to this. And then I love that it has the brown buttons. So you can pair it with black like I did, or you can pull the creams that are kind of on the button and do like browns and creams underneath it, which I feel like would look super cute too. Um, and then I love that it's longer too. I feel like it just fits me really well all over and it's very warm. So depending on where you live, this will be a great winter jacket. So it's like the teddy fabric on the outside and then it's lined with a poly on the inside. And then also too, I love just these huge, big, chunky pockets it has on the breast. Unfortunately, I'm not like a triple, oh my God, no. It does have pockets. Okay, I'm just seeing this. So a lot of H&M's jackets are sewn together, but they do actually have pockets. You just kind of need to get a seam ripper and rip them open, but it has pockets. So that's an even bigger bonus that I did not realize. Um, so yeah, overall, I feel like this is the perfect jacket for me. Could potentially be a shacket for someone else if you go ahead and button it all up. Um, maybe it could be a shacket on me. I think I would just have to belt it. It's just, it's just too much for like, either needs to be tighter or shorter for me. So maybe if I belted it, it could be a shacket. Again, 5'3", around there. So yeah, but I really, really love this thing. Um, this guy is 60 bucks, which I feel like is insane for like a good winter jacket. Insane. Um, and then I got this in an extra small, so it does run a little bit big. So I would definitely size down. I feel like it fits me perfect. And yeah, I just really, really love this feel like it's gonna be my go-to jacket for the year. It's just like easy, it's black. It'll literally go with everything. So next I got these really awesome skinny black jeans and they're kind of like that shine material. So I feel like these are very like holiday-ish type of pants. And let me tell you, these things fit like a glove and I feel like they make my, make my butt look so good. I'm literally obsessed with these. Um, and like I said, they are their skinny, not jeggings, skinny jeans and in petite. So you can't see it here because I'm wearing boots, but they are literally the perfect length on me. Again, I'm 5'3", and I feel like they are the perfect length. So if you're short like me, go with petite. 
um, they fit or the length is perfect. And I got them in a four and they are 26, 25 bucks. Um, and then with these awesome shiny black pants, I paired it with another shacket <laughs> and I got this black and red shacket and this thing is so amazing. I love a good plaid moment. I'm, I feel like I'm always gonna love plaid. It kind of had like a phasing out period, I feel like. Um, and now I feel like I'm seeing it more and I'm super happy about that. Especially this like traditional red and black. It's just like my easy go-to if I want to wear plaid and not be like too much, I go with these two colors. Um, and I love this thing. It is super warm. So the plaid material on the outside is thicker and then it has like this um, quilted fabric on the inside. So this thing is very warm. If you're in a cold state or it's starting to get a lot colder where you live, I would highly recommend this guy. I'm in Portland right now and this thing is perfect for this cold weather. Um, it's honestly the best. Uh, I went ahead and got it in an extra small so I would size down. It runs a little big and this guy's 60 bucks. But like I said, this thing is literally perfect. It has the big pockets on the front. It also has pockets down here. And then I styled this as a jacket. Again, I just did like a black knit top underneath, but you could do this as a shirt as well and button it up. Um, I think I'll probably wear a little more as a jacket or I'll like button up to just like maybe here and wear it as more of like a shirt type, but maybe with just like a turtleneck popping out. Um, so yeah, I'll. Like I said, though, I'll probably wear it more as a jacket just because I feel like sometimes with these like thicker jackets, they are just like too much fabric for me. So I could also probably belt it like that other one, but this guy is so amazing. It's perfect, it's warm, it's inexpensive, and you could wear it as a shirt, depending on your body type, or as a jacket. So with that last pair of black pants, I also styled it with this puffy white jacket. I am literally obsessed with this thing. It is amazing and it is meant to be a jacket, but I actually wore it as a shirt. I did not wear anything underneath. Um, and I kind of think that's how I'll wear it. Maybe I'll do like a white turtleneck popping out underneath, but I like that this can kind of be worn as a shirt too. Obviously, depending on where you live, it might be too hot in certain places, but how amazing is this puffy jacket? Um, I love the color. I love that it's white and then has like the black zipper and then like kind of the black hidden zipper here. The hood too is like legit. This is a legit like rain hood. Um, I don't know if this is necessarily waterproof, but at least you could kind of keep your hair dry. Um, and it like really folds over a lot, which I like that it's not like a little dinky hood. Um, it is normal length um, and then it has the elastic at the bottom, but I really, really like this thing. Oh, and I kind of talked about these, but it has the little hidden pockets on both sides. Um, and I feel like this is just a cool jacket to have. I feel like everyone needs some sort of puffer. I have a longer puffer that I got years ago, but I don't have like a normal size or like a cropped puffer. So saw this guy, knew I needed it, got it. Um, I went ahead and got this in an extra small. I feel like I could go to a small. The extra small fits perfect, um, but I feel like I could go either way. So I guess it's true to size because I feel like maybe the extra small, I don't know. You could go either way. Um, and then this guy is 50 bucks. So yeah, I really love it. I love, again, the colorway. I love how comfy it is. It's like the perfect puffy normal length jacket. And that is it for my huge H&M haul. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you found some pieces that you loved. And if you did, you know the drill. All the links will be down below. But thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and also check me out on Instagram and TikTok. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.